welcome back to the Beta TV studio for today's live episode of You Need This. I'm your host, Noelle, coming to you from San Francisco. I have a question for you. Have you ever wanted to learn how to code? Maybe you've tried learning how to code, takes a lot of time, can be really difficult to understand. Well, we have a product here at Beta that is going to make it fun and easy to learn how to code. It is the Pi Top 4. It is a modular robotics kit that also comes uh, with a computer set. It's gonna teach both kids and adults how to code. Really, really fascinating product. Um, was created uh, by two co-founders in London. Now, one of them has a background in law and politics and the other in engineering. And they actually have won the Guinness World Record for the first 3D printed laptop. How cool is that? So without further ado, um, let's Let's kick it over to Nick, our general manager at Beta Mission Bay, to show us the product. He's got the laptop there as well as the robotics kit. Um, Nick, thanks so much for joining us today. Hey, Noel. Thanks. Hey. Okay. So obviously this product is a little complex, um, but once you get the hang of it, there are so many different you know, educational opportunities with it. Um, so let's, let's just start, Nick. I would love to know why is it called PyTop? Yeah, so the name is actually coming from uh, the computer itself, which is what powers everything here, which is called a Raspberry Pi. While that does sound like a delicious dessert, uh, <laughs> I thought so myself, it's actually um, a name of a foundation that started in the UK uh, that was really designed and dedicated to build a very easy to use open platform for people to be able to understand uh, robotics and programming and sort of the base modules of, you know, what you need to know to, to be in that kind of an industry and, and understand how it works. Mm -hmm. Great. What are some of the educational, what's the educational value, Nick, here for, for, for children who are learning how to code? Well, you know, the Pi Top is actually a very core part, you know, any Raspberry Pi setup actually is going to be a very core part of any STEM uh, learning cur curriculum and STEM for uh, most parents out there will know what that is. A lot of schools have curriculums built around that. STEM stands for science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. And um, STEM programs are really designed, again, to uh, get kids comfortable with, you know, these new types of, uh, you know, education that are a part of the modern world that, you know, didn't mm -hmm. exist, you know, 20, 30 years ago. So um, these programs are so, so vital in teaching kids, you know, what these are and how they work. And, um, yeah. What's really interesting is that, you know, PyTop actually has their own program called Further that actually um, provides a lot of different hours of uh, different module training and stuff so that you actually have a lot of content to be able to use your uh, Raspberry Pi with. Very cool. So we have a, a quick video that I'd love to play so that people can kind of... So really cool. I mean, you can see some examples there. I, there is like an endless list of different things that you can create and build. And obviously the Raspberry Pi is, is powering all of that. Um, I love that you said that it, it sounds like a delicious dessert. It really does. Um, tell us more about how the Raspberry Pi works within the Pi Top. Yeah, so the Raspberry Pi is just a credit card size computer that's essentially running uh, Linux, which is, you know, uh, if you think about, you know, iOS or, or Mac OS and you think of Windows, Linux is an open source platform that really is just very easy for people to learn how to do the basics of computing. So um, the brain, if you think about it that way, is the Raspberry Pi, and that's what they've contained here. Now, uh, Raspberry Pi is going to be a little bit smaller than this, actually. They've built a really beautiful, very durable casing for this, which is great. Um, and gives you all the, you know, sort of ports you're going to need to get started here. Um, the robotics kit I have here, you can see there's tons more ports here because, again, you're learning how to code and it's going to be able to do things like turn lights on and off on a device, uh, initiate sounds, uh, you know, be able to drive a, you know, little buggy like this around. Um, just tons of functionality and you're really just teaching, uh, you know, the brain how to get everything else to, to do what it needs to do. Right. And what else comes in the kit, Nick? So the robotics kit comes with uh, the you know little computer itself, the Raspberry Pi. So mm -hmm. the Pi Top itself is going to come with that kit. Um, they also have a, what they call a little bento box, uh, which is very cute, of 
Um, a lot of the lighting sound parts that you're gonna you know, want as a part of this kit. And you can kind of see, uh, we've got a few of them attached here and there's also some more in here, but you get a pretty robust kit right out of the box with this, which is nice so that you can start yourself on literally hundreds of projects. So you're good to go right out of the box. Um, getting into the coding part, you know, this will definitely connect up to an existing computer or laptop. So you don't have to start from scratch if you wanted to do that. But if you want to kind of keep it all in the family, we do sell their um, separate accessory of the uh, screen, which is uh, attached to a Bluetooth keyboard here. Um, again, this all folds up very easily, very compact. You can take it with you anywhere, you know, do projects outside. And again, this is designed to make coding and programming fun and to take it out of just, you know, sort of a, a laboratory environment or just in your house. And this is, you know, something you can take outside, even do projects outside, uh, you know, with, with different projects as well. Awesome. And I mentioned, Nick, that this is for both kids and adults. Um, what, what do you think is sort of the youngest age that can really, you know, get into a product like this and engage with it and, and understands kind of the, the learning aspect of it? Yeah, I mean, we have a lot of different uh, families come through beta and mm -hmm. the product itself is rated for 12 and up, but mm -hmm. we've certainly had, you know, eight year olds, 10 year olds that are again wow. doing STEM learning that are, you know, very familiar with coding already. And so um, right. it's a fantastic tool for that. You know, parents sometimes may look at these and think, you know, uh, it's it's a little bit, you know, complex or it's a little bit too much money or what have you, you know, for mm -hmm. their for their kid. but when you realize that this is beyond just sort of what people have come to expect from an educational tool um, where it's just giving you a few basic functions, it's, it's sort of passive learning through a screen or what have you. This is very hands-on, very interactive learning that is yeah. just so essential for children who are showing and expressing interests in things like engineering and mathematics um, so that they, you know, they are powering the you know, designs and visions of our future. Definitely, yeah, a great educational investment, especially for the future of a child with all of these different, you know, uh, future careers in STEM. Um, this is a great way, I think, to get them learning about, you know, coding and everything uh, from a young age. Really, really awesome product. I know it's pretty new here to beta. Um, Nick, you know so much, and people can head on into Mission Bay and ask you more questions. So thank you so much for telling us a little bit more about it here today on Beta TV. Um, and you guys can find uh, the robotics kit as well as the um, computer online at beta.com. And of course, like I said, head on into Mission Bay or your local uh, beta store to learn more. Thank you again for joining me. We'll be back here in the Beta TV studio again for more episodes of You Need This. Bye.